One Piece, Luffy's Best Fight from Every Saga, Ranked Being the main protagonist of the anime One Piece, Luffy has been in some of the most fights of the series. Here are his best fights from every saga. As the main character of One Piece, Luffy is bound to have plenty of fights, more than every other character. It's guaranteed that at every given major story arc, he'll have the spotlight in regards to the quantity and quality of fights experienced. It's gotten to the point where tracking each of Luffy's individual battles became hard for the average fans, two decades worth of content is nothing to brush at. That being said, despite the satisfaction we feel every single time Luffy connects a solid punch to someone's face, there are only a few notable battles, which Luffy had been featured in, that stand prominent in comparison to the rest. Here are Luffy's cream de la cream of fights in each story saga. One Piece, Luffy's best fight from every saga, ranked. Being the main protagonist of the anime One Piece, Luffy has been in some of the most fights of the series. Here are his best fights from every saga. As the main character of One Piece, Luffy is bound to have plenty of fights, more than every other character. It's guaranteed that at every given major story arc, he'll have the spotlight in regards to the quantity and quality of fights experienced. It's gotten to the point where tracking each of Luffy's individual battles became hard for the average fans, two decades worth of content is nothing to brush at. That being said, Despite the satisfaction we feel every single time Luffy connects a solid punch to someone's face, there are only a few notable battles, which Luffy had been featured in, that stand prominent in comparison to the rest. Here are Luffy's cream de la cream of fights in each story saga. 8. Alabasta Saga, Luffy vs. Crocodile the Alabasta Saga was the opening saga of the Grand Line Grand Saga. The saga featured a few arcs with the Alabasta arc as the central arc. This saga's final squad of bad guys was the Baroque Works, an organization headed by one of the series' most iconic villains, Crocodile. Luffy's fight against Crocodile was the main event of this saga. It was in this arc that we got to first-hand experience Luffy's inhuman durability and strong will. 7. Sky Island Saga, Luffy vs. Enel Of all the story arcs of One Piece, the Skypiea arc, the main chunk of the Sky Island Saga, is undoubtedly the arc with the most mixed reviews. In fact, many fans felt cheated due to the build-up and event sequences in the arc. The arc itself and its execution were magnificent, to say the least. It was the decisive battle that disappointed some of the fans. The negative reviews were mostly complaints about how a wasted potential Enel was, with just bits of tweaking, the character known as Enel could have easily gotten a much better role in the New World Grand Saga. 6. Water 7 Saga, Luffy vs. Luchi the Straw Hats character arcs always perform so much better than the regular story arc. That can mainly be attributed to the abundance of emotions in each of these special character arcs. Nico Robin was the central figure of the Eni's lobby arc, the Straw Hats invaded an essential world government facility in order to rescue her, the premise alone hooked up a bunch of fans. The Straw Hats each had an opponent during this arc, and Luffy, as usual, took the main dish for himself. Luffy vs. Luchi was most definitely one of the most hype-inducing battles in the series. 5. Thriller Bark Saga, Luffy vs. Moria On its own, the Thriller Bark Saga was definitely a thrilling watch. However, when compared with its counterpart arcs, it may come out as lacking. Perhaps it was the premise or the dark vibes, maybe, the point being, it's subpar at best when the grand scheme of things is taken into consideration. The final fight between Luffy and Moria also leaves a lot to be desired. It was somehow different from the conventional One Piece fights that we were used to. 4. Summit War Saga, Luffy vs. Everyone 
The Summit War saga was an emotional roller coaster that led to one gigantic fight, a fight so gigantic that it was beyond Luffy's sphere of influence. In such a large scale battle, comparing Luffy to a slightly stronger cannon fodder wouldn't be underestimating his capabilities at the time. Frankly, picking one prominent fight from this magnificent saga would be doing it a disservice. Each fight was unique and entertaining on its own right. 3. Fishman Island Saga, Luffy vs. Hody Jones As the first major story arc following the time skip, the Fishman Island sure did generate loads of hype, which was all justified. The arc in question was the first arc after two years worth of rigorous training. It was only natural for the fans to be immensely excited. The Fishman Island arc wasn't necessarily a bad arc, but having said so, it just didn't match up with the pre-built unrealistic hype. Hody Jones and his gang of evil fishmen weren't enough to push the straw hats to their utmost limits. 2. Dress Rosa Saga, Luffy vs. Doflamingo The final fight against Doflamingo was the first post-timeskip fight in which we truly learned of Luffy's limits. It was also during this fight Luffy's Gear 4th debuted. It was the technique we had all been patiently waiting for Luffy to unleash, his result of two years of concentrated training. The fight itself was beyond phenomenal. There were many twists and turns that had us on edge for tens of episodes. 1. Yonko Saga, Luffy vs. Katakuri Lastly, the best fight in the current Yonko saga has to be Luffy vs. Katakuri. That fight was heads above Doflamingo vs. Luffy, it was so brilliantly executed that we forgot to breathe. One of the reasons why this particular fight turned out as well as it did was due to the opponent, Katakuri. He is the most capable individual within the Big Mom Pirates and a well-rounded character that the fans can't seem to get enough of. <laughs>